Is barley really as cheap as everyone says it is in 2022? Well, in today's video, we are going to be taking you through four days of visiting must-visit places around Bali without budgeting to show you guys how cheap Bali really is. We are starting at zero pounds, but we are currently staying at the Omham Retreat and Resort. We are staying here for the next five nights, and that is 24 pounds each night for the two of us, including breakfast. Let's not forget about the bike that we are renting for the next four days, which is costing us 150,000 per day. Now let's go get some breakfast. So we are heading to Suka Espresso this morning for breakfast. It's based in more central Ubud around all the local cafes and bars. So we're gonna go there as we actually went there with the girls a couple of days ago and the food was delicious. So we definitely wanna take you guys with us. So we just quickly nipped back to the hotel as um, I lost the um, huh, I lost the debit card. Oh yeah, so I lost the debit card, froze that, so that's all sorted. I did go back to the ATM. It wasn't in there, wasn't in the shop opposite, so someone's taking it, but they haven't spent any money because there's no money on it because we're poor. Yeah, we just come back from the cafe. It cost us 322,000 roughly. So yeah, we're about to nip out. We're going to Tagalalalalang Rice Terrace to see what all the fuss is about there. But yeah, we'll take you with us now. Yeah, you're sitting in a little lover, are you? Just, you know, getting my Instagram self on. People keep telling us that it's Tagalog, but I just keep seeing Uma checking everywhere. Oh, yeah. Like, I haven't seen Tagalog anywhere. Are we at the wrong... I, I don't know anymore. This doesn't seem I very... Just, I'm, I'm really struggling to get my head around how this is Tagalog. Like, just need confirmation. Because there's nothing saying Tagalog. But everyone who's local here says this is Tagalog. Like, it's not impressive. I'm not sure. We're just going to keep walking aimlessly in hope for more confirmation, I think. Whip the drone up now and uh, see if we're in the right place. I think we can confirm it is to la 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 lang Beautiful gonna... and it's so green as well. But yeah, we're going to head back now. We're now going to go and just chill out at a day club. It's called Kretya Day Club and we will take you there now. It is very nice. Yeah, we actually went there with the girls when they were here. But we're going to go and enjoy it in the daytime, although I think it's just started to rain. So in Ubud. typical, yeah, we're going to say in typical <laughs> Ubud fashion, it's raining. But yeah, we're going to head there now. It actually costs us 50000 each to get in just to do the walk tour. And if you want to have a go on all the swings and use all the facilities here, then you pay 300,000 each. But because we paid 50,000 each to do the walk, we're going to add that to the tally now and watch it go up. <laughs> so it did rain. It's absolutely chucking it down. We got caught in it. This is my protection. And we have now arrived at Kretcher Club. It has cost us 50,000 each just for a standard entry ticket. So 100,000 total. So we'll add that to the pot now and let's go get some lunch. Oh. Yeah, you got our umbrella. Don't need this hat anymore. See, the girls have left and they've they've taken the sun with them now. Yeah. <laughs> Unbelievable. Just shows it's not all sunshines and rainbows, is it? It's absolutely pissing it down. But yeah, we're going to get some food now. I've ordered a double cheeseburger. Lauren's ordered a normal cheeseburger. cheeseburger yeah. In these, I don't want to say posher, but in these more upmarket places. Western. Western places. places. Yeah. The food's the same price regardless whether you get for local or Western. So the double yeah. cheeseburger, my one, was 155000 But then for a nasi garang, which we can get for 20, 30,000 was like 120,000, yeah. which is insane. So with Bali, it's very different to Thailand. With Thailand, the Western food and the local food is a very different price, yeah. even when you go to the more Western places. So that's why we literally barely ate any Western food in Thailand, because it was like double yeah. and it was silly. Whereas here, I think that's why we kind of ate probably a bit more Western than we yeah. planned, just because the prices doesn't really We eat make a, a hell difference. of a lot more Western food yeah. in Bali than we did in Thailand, 100%. In terms of like how a day club can look, this is pinnacle of how cool they get, really. 
Yeah, it's definitely a must visit. If you've got a group with you, it's great because you can get a bed. You have a minimum spend of like one point, yeah. and if anything from like one million upwards. I think to depend on where you sit. Yeah. But when it's split between a group of you, it's just so much. It's so much better. This food is absolutely mega. These chips as well. What are they called? The parmesan. The parmesan potatoes. But I swapped mine out for just some. Standard old oh, yeah. french fries which are also really good. We just finished up having some food. We've made our way down to the left of Kretzia Club where they've got some rice fields and some swings and then there's this big gorilla head in a hill which is kind of the main reason why we've come down here because we've seen this on social media so it looks really cool. So if you just want to go for a walk you don't have to pay any additional charge but I think if you want to get photos on the swing or go on the swings then you have to pay a little bit yeah, extra don't you? But yeah the food was 400,000 so we'll add that to the tally now. So it's turning out to be an expensive day. <laughs> I think we were saying earlier, we were like, we are going to probably be really shocked with actually how much we, yeah. we spent, but even we, though we yeah. know. But we want this to be as realistic as possible. If you are coming here to Bali, this is a very realistic approach of what you'll be spending, where you'll be going. So yeah, someone's got to do it for I everyone. I just find it really funny how there's loads of like little nest yeah, areas for nest. photos. Wow. Yeah, go on then. I don't know. Thank going you. for a wonder. It's like we've got a kid on a leash. No, me that fools. Oh my goodness. <laughs> How are you supposed to make this look elegant? Look at me. Let me try, let me try and do it properly, one minute. <laughs> That's just no good, is it? Run quick! <laughs> but yeah, okay, next thing. So we've just finished up at the Kretia Club. We went round, had a walk around the rice fields, did a load of walking, all that fun stuff. Now we're going back to the hotel to kind of chill, relax, go out for dinner tonight, not sure where we're gonna go. Yeah, that's pretty much it for today. And then tomorrow we are actually doing something that we've been planning on doing for, for a while. Ages. And we are so excited. We are climbing Mount Batur. Another thing we've got to take into consideration is we are gonna be buying some snacks. So we're about to go to a market now before we go back to the hotel. Gonna get a load of snacks, get some fuel for Water. Mount Batur. Yeah. <laughs> and then uh, we'll show you how much that costs as well. So we just made it into a papito to get some bits and bobs. Lauren needs some new hand wash. Face wash? I threw hand my wash. face wash down the toilet this morning and Reese got it out and I was like, nah, there's some weird stuff in that. There was poo in it. Yeah, probably yours. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we're going to get some snacks now for Mount Batur tomorrow and we'll let you guys know what we get and how much it was. <laughs> oh, I think not. Prunes instead. The fuel of the gods. Good old Red Bull. Can I have a bag, please? <laughs> that came to 210,000, basically. So adding that onto our total for today as well. So it is currently 10 to 8, and me and Lauren have just got a quick little snack. We've managed to get ourselves some gyozas, which are, how'd you rate them, are they good? Mm. Yeah? It was 150,000 for 15 of them. But yes, we're gonna have these, and then we are going to head to bed, because we are up at half past two in the morning. We're getting picked up at 3 a.m. tomorrow to go clown Mount Batur. So we will call it for tonight, and we will catch you guys in the morning. It's currently 3 a.m. Um, just get we're literally drivers just outside. We're gonna get we're getting picked up and we're going to well you know where we're going. We're going to Mount Batur. There's no other reason we get up so early. <laughs> we're going now, getting in the taxi, and we'll meet you at the bottom. Oh Can't look at the camera because the light's too bright. We've started Mount Batur. It is pitch black. Fortunately they gave me a coat, which I will be taking off now because it is boiling. But yeah, gonna hike now. I think it should take around two hours to get up. How are you getting on, babe? Knackered. It's hot. It is hot. It's very hot. Yeah, to rub it in, there's loads of cars driving up and down. Yeah, I keep seeing bikes and cars going up and down. I can easily put my ego aside just to get a car up. Oh. To halfway. Yeah, to, to halfway. halfway. Oh. halfway. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ten minutes to the end. That's the best thing I've heard all morning. <laughs> Halfway. I've gone from having a coat on and feeling cold to having a t-shirt now I'm practically naked. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Oh my god, that's so steep. Oh. So terrain's changed a lot now. I think it's about to get a little bit more difficult. I tell you what, this GoPro light lights up the entire earth. Oh, this is nice. Oh, uh, this is halfway. What's the snacks? Yeah. We don't have any money for snacks. Whose fault is that? <laughs> Mine. <laughs> Put the debit card in to get some more money out. It nearly ate the card up. I was there for about five minutes waiting for my money. Nothing. No card, no nothing. So our again. driver's wife um, prepared us croissants with jam and butter. Oh, our driver, you'll see him after we get back down. He's amazing. So cute. Absolutely amazing. Yeah, he's paying for our trip. We he's, at the moment, he is paying for our trip. So thank you very much. <laughs> oh. Oh. Decided to take a shortcut. Shorter by one minute. Oh, okay, I was going to say. Oh, man. Oh, it's difficult not being able to hold on to anything. <laughs> ah, bug. I think we're past halfway. We've done about 60 minutes now. About roughly four kilometers. Not that that means anything to us because we didn't look at how much Mount Batora is. So far, the shortcut's okay. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, where's my hand? <laughs> no one looks after the men. We just get left to fall to our death. Oh, you going on all right, babe? Great. Yeah. We, we made, made it to the it. top. I don't want to speak too soon, but I think there's potential there. Fingers crossed. We'll see, it looks really oh, stunning. It wasn't too bad. No. Oh, thank you. It's oh. our amazing guide. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> um, I'd definitely say Snowdon was harder. Yeah, really? we only rested once on the way up, which is good going, but yeah. it was more to just kind of get past the people. Yeah. And our guide took us through some shortcuts, so we managed to skip around, didn't we? Yeah. Some ropey. <laughs> but it's very foggy. You can only just see where the sun's trying to peek through. Fingers but yeah, we'll see. It. Fingers crossed. Gets clearer. I'll put a little time lapse on now. What do you think of the view, babe? It's great, best view ever. <laughs> so glad I did it. <laughs> it was nice for like 15 minutes. And it's actually a lot colder than I thought it would be. <laughs> I'm okay at the moment, but yeah, it's a bit chilly. But we're from England, so it's okay. <laughs> Are you ready, boss? Yes, boss. The boss is taking us. <laughs> Even on top of an active volcano, Bruce. you still can't get away from the bracelet. So I'm just done. Um... <laughs> 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 oh. It's good because it, it doesn't make me see how high up we are. <laughs> oh, don't. We are th I don't. I think it's good that it's. I think it's good that it's a little bit foggy because I don't a think if Lauren bit, yeah. could handle it if she saw how high up we were. And how narrow we this is to walk on and be off the edge. <laughs> no, thank you. I'll ban jump the door. Bata. <laughs> I can't get over how narrow this bit is. We'll go back and do that. Oh my god, Reese. <laughs> oh wow, oh my god, yeah, it gets hot really quick. Yeah? Yeah. Is it quite up here? Yeah, yeah. Oh, smoke scan. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, we got. Make it an option. <laughs> oh god, oh god. Let's not do that, shall we? Let's, let's not do that. <laughs> We're literally away from everyone now. It is so quiet. Crazy quiet. Crazy quiet, but all you can hear is me going. <laughs> Just sliding down. Just sliding down. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> So after that slippy slidey bit, which was rather fun, we're now back on the trail that we came up on. Oh, is this exactly what we came up on? And how long will it take to get down, roughly? Maybe 45 minutes, one hour? An hour. One hour. Yeah, one hour. So. 45 minutes, please. <laughs> Lauren's been put into the trekking sandwich so she can be protected from all angles because <laughs> yeah. she cannot be trusted to just walk on her own. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Back there to we it. Go. <laughs> <laughs> So 
So we did it, but we've decided to sack off the rest of the walk. It is literally just a road all the way down, isn't it? So we're going to get our lovely taxi driver to come and collect us. But we did the main walk down, so we still achieved something. Oh my God. You've come to save us. You're right, boss. <laughs> hey. You're the best driver in the world. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's time to go get some food. We need ATM and then the best local food in Bali, Indonesia. <laughs> Who is it? I'm riding. <laughs> the best. The best food in Kintamani is Mujair. Mujair. Uh, Mujair. Jair nyat nyat. Nyat nyat. Mujair nyat nyat. Right, so summing up how much we have spent today, it was 550,000 each to do a private Mount Bator tour. So that brings us to 1.1 million. But that also was... included picking us up and dropping us off yes. as well, wasn't that it? Was, that was including pick up and drop off, which is what we're doing now. It was 100,000 to get in and it was 5,000 donation to go for a week. Or if you wait, it's free on the volcano. Oh, I could have yeah, got the adding that, to our, adding that to our total so far. But yeah, we've finished up at Malpator. It was an amazing experience, even though we didn't get the sunrise we wanted. But we are going to go and get some food now. Yeah, so and we was, had an incredible tour guide as well. She looked yeah. after me the hot way. Yeah, she, yeah, she was amazing. She babysitted Lauren, little Bambi legs. <laughs> Literally. Yeah, we're going to get some food now and we'll show you where we go, what we get and how much it costs.